What's up, YouTube? Today I'm going to show you guys how to fix your StarCraft lap problem. Most of you guys, you go to make a game and you can't figure out how to make a game with people to join. What you need to do is to fix your ports so that you can make games. You're going to need to know three things. You're going to need to know your default IP address, your IP address, and your router username and password. I'll show you how to get these two things right now. You're going to need to go to start, and then if you're on XP, there should be run over here. You just click that and type in IP config. If you're on Vista or Windows 7, you can just go to all programs, accessories, command prompt. Black screen will come up. You're going to type in IP config, I-P-C-O-N-F-I-G, and then you're going to click enter. And once you do that, you're going to have something pop up that looks like this with a whole bunch of numbers and stuff over here. You're going to need to know your default gateway and your IP address. Your once you know those two things, you need to pull up internet. In your I or in your address bar, you type in your default gateway. So 192.168. some number. dot some number. All right, and then once that happens, once you do that, you're going to come up to your screen, and it's going to be your internet service provider screen or your router screen. For me, it's Verizon. For you, it might be Comcast or whatever it is you have. And then you're going to need to know your username and password. If you've never seen this screen before in your life, and you don't think you know what your username or password is, it's probably the default settings, which is what they gave you from the beginning. And I'll have a link in my description to show you what your default password and username would be. So let me enter my stuff. Alright, and then once you enter, you're going to come to a screen like this. And it's going to, and you need to go to firewall settings. You're going to have all this stuff up here. You need to go to firewall settings. And then once you click on that, it's going to say warning. These, are ch these changes may affect your blah, 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 blah. Don't worry about it. Just click yes. Alright, then you need to go over here to port forwarding. Once you're at, and click port forwarding, and then it's going to have a whole list of all your ports that your router contains. Right, right now, I have two Blizzard Battle.nets. I don't need to. But anyway, you're going to need to ha open your ports to 6112. So to do that, you're just going to need to go to the top, scroll down and it's going to say your IP address which is for me 192.168.1.2 alright so you click that and then for over here to application to forward you want to go to blizzardbattle.net there it is alright and make sure you click advanced settings most of the times you'll have to click advanced settings some routers it just automatically comes up but anyway, you need to make sure that your WAN connection type is on all broadband devices. And your forward to port, you want to go to specify. And then a box will pop up. You want to type in 6112. And schedule always. And then click add. And then it'll have it'll add it all down here. So now I have three. I only need one. Normally this first one up here would be your original, which would be like some random numbers like TCP, that's 6185, something or another. You don't need that. Make sure you delete it so it doesn't interfere with the one you just created. I don't know why I have two, so I'm just going to delete that one too. Alright. I don't know what that is. Alright, so make sure you delete those. And then go back down and make sure that you save or apply or create or whatever it is that's down there but you want to make sure that you save it so that it doesn't just go back to original settings and then you want to log out and then you want to turn your router off and restart it whether you have to unplug it or just there's a switch but you got to make sure that you turn your router completely off and then turn it back on for all your stuff to update once that happens you should be able to make if not, look in the link to the description, and there's a step-by-step -step, uh, individual router guide to how you do it yourself. So it would be the link is port forwarding dot com. Just click that. Go to port checker. 
And you scroll down, there should be a long list. Oh, router list. You need to click router list. There's a long list of all the routers. All kinds of crap. Make sure you click and you need to know the exact numbers. It'll say it on the back or on the bottom. Somewhere on your router there should be a sticker and it says your exact serial number. So you want to make sure you click the right one and it'll give you a step-by-step. -step. Click here to skip the advertisement. It'll give you a step-by-step. -step. Oh, you need to find your game too. So StarCraft. Starcraft, 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 Starcraft. <laughs> Not there yet. Starcraft. All right, there it is. And then it'll tell you what you need to do. All this crap for each individual router. But my video should help you. If not, then do this. But thanks for watching. Hope this helps. Post up.